Let me just close my door. I said, oh my gosh, it's 11. I love you guys. Thanks for being like, subscribe and share it. And when you get a chance, hit that notification button down below so you're notified when I post my videos. You guys are here ready to go. I know that's right. I know that's right. So uh, Leo and, uh, guys, hold on. My door's a little ratchet, so I have to close it. You know, my management company never fix shit, but anyway that's neither here nor there moon and leo today you may feel a lot of sexual energy you may feel very sexual oh leo and venus i think it's leo and venus if i'm not mistaken don't quote me on that it's in something and it's a very sensual energy okay because yeah no i'm not where's my girl astro girl 444 she would know so energy is energy if it resonates i feel like we just i just hopped on and you guys were here and i love that i think that's so amazing so um i can't wait for some more people to get in the chat in the meantime like i said before send your um send your oh you guys you guys if you guys want to donate to the channel or send tarot cards okay but what I was saying is you know, make sure you guys hit that notification button down below. Email me, sunshinegoddess333 at gmail.com. Somebody's freeing themselves from any situation that hold them back to come, uh, that's holding them back from being with you. Let the lovers be with the lovers and the players be with the players. There's a huge change going on in the collective. Listen, a lot of these of my masculines are waking up and they're like, or not. I'm not dealing with this. I don't have to. I don't want to. A lot of them are growing out of the energy of pride and ego. Well, this doesn't make me feel good. And it most definitely isn't good for my health, my safety, my life. So I'm going to walk away from that. So I love that I see in my walking everyday life that there are divine masculines standing up for themselves, making changes. Don't hang out with me. You're going to fix your whole life. You're going to start working out. You're going to want to be a better person. Don't, don't hang out with me. You're going to be better. And a lot of these masculine energies are, you know, it's it's time for change. A lot of change has been happening in the collective. A lot of masculine energies have been waking up. Now, listen, if you're a woman, okay, born with the uterus, okay, um, and you don't thrive in your femininity, you will become sick in your mind and body. And, okay, you could be a real one, but you also need to thrive in your femininity, especially if you have children. So I see a lot of women, especially where I live, that they thrive in their masculine energy. And it's so hard to even get along with women like that because here you're trying to be on your cute girl things and they're like side-eyeing you and you think you're better. No, you know I'm better. I don't think at all. I don't I don't have to think that. I already know. So so I feel like it's an energy where a lot of these masculine energies dealt with women that were in their super masculine energy weren't able to show up as a person that they can be and got comfortable there and then they met a feminine woman and it changed their perspective on life now don't don't mistake an a feminine woman with a, a girl or a woman we're talking about femininity and leave the soft girl air stuff out of it which i love which i, I love but a woman that's in tune with her feminine side a woman that's nurturing loving caregiving patient Okay, just because you have ass and titties doesn't make you a woman. Just because you can bear children, yes, in reference to anatomical, physical, but having children and being a mom doesn't make you literally a woman. So I feel like they've they've come across this energy where, um, this is a weird candle. They've come across different energies, you know, where where it wasn't as feminine or, you know, or maybe they're overbearing feminine energies, right? Where they're like trying to be their mom and they're like trying to do everything for them. And there it seems, it almost seems like it's trying to buy their love and let me do your laundry, skirt, skirt. Okay, we are not doing wife duties for 